India has a unique strategic character. It will not be an ally of the United States. It will. It has a, a desire to be an independent, powerful state. It is. A, it will be another great power. I know of no bilateral relationship that is ding deepened and strengthened more rapidly than the United States and India over the last 20 years. My own personal view is by far and away the most important bilateral relationship for the United States into the 21st century is India, and that we have to invest even more of our uh, capacity in building people-to-people -people ties, working together on technology and the like. I, I, I do think it is important to keep in mind and Joe, you worked on India before many of us does. India has a unique strategic character. It will not be an ally of the United States. It will. It has a, a desire to be an independent, powerful state. It is. A, it will be another great power. But I think there are reasons to believe that our strategic alignment is growing across the board in almost every arena. I think there are inhibitions in both of our bureaucracies. There are many challenges. I've seen them myself. But I do believe that this is a relationship that should have some ambition. We should look at things that we can do, do, do together, whether it's in space, whether it's education, whether it's on climate, whether it's on technology, and really move in that direction. If you look over the last 20 years and look at the hurdles that have been surmounted and the depth of engagement between our two sides, it's remarkable. And, and I would also say it is not simply built on anxiety around China. It is a deeper understanding of the importance of the synergies between our societies. The Indian diaspora here is a powerful connection. I'm very bullish on the Quad and has led to a strengthening and deepening of coordination between these four key maritime democracies. Yeah.